Welcome to the support videos for workload automation. This video will demonstrate how to create a connection profile on Control M for Informatica. Before you can define a Control M for Informatica job, you need to create a connection profile in the Control M Configuration Manager, which enables you to connect to the required Informatica server. The following procedure describes how to create it. Open a session on the Control M Configuration Manager. Do right click over the Control M for Informatica component. Select Connection Profile Management. Click the plus symbol icon. Enter a name for the connection profile. On the next screen, we need to enter the connection parameters to a specified Informatica server. These values can be easily found in the Informatica Administration Console. Ask your Informatica Administrator for assistance. The first two values are related to the Informatica Web Services Hub. So we go to the Informatica Administrator Console, look for the Web Services Hub, in this case, this is my web services hub. And take the values from the properties. We need the hub host name and the hub port number. The next value is the power center domain name. This component is the root in the Informatica tree, as you can see here. So we go and type this value. It is very important to type it exactly as it appears in the Informatica Administrator Console. Next, we need the repository. Here is how this component looks on the Informatica Console. We continue with the integration service that we can find here. Now we can proceed to type the Informatica username and password. It is very important that you validate that this user can log in on the Informatica repository before creating the connection profile. On the next screen, we configure the connection type used by the Informatica Web Services Hub. It can be HTTP or HTTPS. We can validate this value in the Informatica console. As you can see here, my Web Services Hub is using HTTP, so I will keep it as this. We click Next. And now we can test our connection profile. The validation is successful. Finally, we click Finish to save it. That concludes this Control M Solutions video. Please see our knowledge base and YouTube channel for more videos like this. Thank you.